Oh my gosh, we just walked into her house and Judith Ward is gonna woohoo with us in her bed. <gasps> Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm Kelsey and I'm single. So I thought it would be funny if I tried the 1 million gold digger challenge. It's a challenge in The Sims 4 where you have one gold digger who makes a million simoleons only by marrying other Sims. There's a couple of other rules to this challenge. I will put them below. Last time we had the most festive episode I think I've ever made which was marriage of us to Santa. This may be the season finale, it may not be. We do have to have one baby with Santa and then start marrying someone else. So this might be the penultimate or the ultimate depending on what happens in this episode, but I thought I would dress for the occasion if this is the final episode. If you've been following along, you'll know that we have to reach 1 million simoleons in our inventory as well as finish the mansion baron aspiration. We also need to have one child for every marriage and also have a fancy dinner party to show that we are the perfect wife before we can divorce our husbands or wives. So let's jump in. All right, so we're still here. Kaylee Bailey is not pregnant with Santa's baby, but we do want Santa to hurry down the chimney tonight. Also, some of you were like, you didn't go ice skating. I was waiting for after. No, I totally forgot. So thanks for telling me that I didn't skate. Kaylee Bailey, shouldn't you be Kaylee Frost? I feel like she needs to be Kaylee Frost. Hold up. I gotta change her name. She's been Kaylee. Kaylee Bailey since Thorn. That was like a couple marriages ago. She's now Kaylee Frost. Ugh, love her. I like Frost as a last name. Some of you said my baby might not be magical because he moved into our household. I'm a little sad about that. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of wish we would have gotten pregnant sooner. And Cash, I believe, is aging up in this episode. So it is baby's birthday and then it's Cash's birthday and then it is, what is that kid's name? Louie's birthday. Oh my God, I forgot Louie's name. But regardless, our girl is going out. She is excited to be going ice skating for her wedding. There she goes. And she wants to build a snow pal with another sim. There's Kaylee Frost skating on her own, on her lonesome. She also wants to have a snowball fight. She is in full Hallmark Christmas movie mode right now. I tell you. But we have good old St. Nick's money right now. So we do the last thing of Mansion Baron, which is have a more expensive house, which may, you know, cost a lot. All right, Kaylee, that's enough. Let's all go home. We had our winter fun but I think it's time to go back to the house so that we can get Clement out of our house, you know? We've been having a holly jolly holiday, but maybe it's time for, you know, some new year, new me. You know what I'm saying? Kaylee's heading home with really needing to pee. Oh my goodness. We're also going to be like coming up on too many kids for the household. However, some of you have pointed out that I do have mods that could expand the household. I do think that's kind of funny for her to just have 10 kids. <laughs> and not worrying about, you know, moving them out too quickly because I just, I can't imagine Cash, you know, not with us. Our sweet little artistic prodigy bean. Oh my gosh, I love you, Cash. Go play your piano. Tickle the ivories. That's adorable. Oh, our sweet bean. I love reading your guys' like little writings about Cash with his therapist. It's like the funniest thing. So please keep writing them. Poor baby Cash probably needs the most therapy out of the Impeach Schmidt children. Oh, let's uh, try for a baby in the shower with Clement. We do need to have a baby with Santa and we do need to take a shower. Oh, don't, don't we? No, we don't actually. Actually, we just need, we're hungry. Never mind. I thought I was killing two birds with one stone, but I'm really not. Octavia Moon, yeah, you can. Oh my God, what if Octavia and us become friends ever since we ditched Thorn Bailey? They'd be like an ex-wives club. <gasps> All right, I'm going to create a club and it's going to be the ex-wives club. Okay, it's me and who else is an ex-wife? Octavia Moon. <laughs> Is that it? Bella Goth actually is an ex-wife too, I believe, unless they got back together, unless the Goths got back together. All right, fabulous. We have an ex-wives club. Club activities are like drinking, not mixing bar drinks, drinking bar drinks. There it is, drinking bar drinks. <laughs> Chewie's very excited about this. I'm also very excited about this. Being friendly to each other. Oh wait, not everyone, just in the club, just in the ex-wives club. You don't have to be friendly to other people. That's all, that's all they do. Amazing. Haley has successfully created the ex wives club we will definitely have a gathering at some point soon i love that kaylee like is in a club with two wives that she's the reason why they're ex-wives but she doesn't care she wants friends it's time you know oh god just gonna go away to cash over here having a lovely time doing his piano dior you're stinky go take a shower oh dior don't go in there don't go in there dior 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 
Oh my gosh. Go take a pregnancy text. I thought Dior was going in this bathroom. Not that bathroom. Well, at least she walked in after the fact, you know? Do we have a baby? Please let us have a baby. Okay, we are officially pregnant with Clement Frost's child. She's gonna go tell Clement, you know, uh, I've got a present for you. It is your child. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Yes! We're expecting a little elf of our own. Okay, well, she's tired and hungry. So let's have her eat something really quick. Go get some leftovers, queen. Oh my God, our baby's upset. Poor Bentley. Oh no. Santa can come change your diaper. Chanel is talking to the baby. Chanel, why don't you stop so that Clement can change the diaper, please? Chanel, okay, go, go sleep here. Stop talking to the baby, Chanel. Chanel's like, it's like a baby doll. I wanna play with it. I'm like, no, Chanel, it's not a fake baby doll that you can play with whenever you want. It is a real baby. Great, the baby's happy again. Kaylee ate her food and she's good. Hash, why don't you go eat and then use the bathroom? Dior is playing on the monkey bars in the backyard. So happy for her, so cute. Kaylee's passed out. Clement like isn't even sleeping in the bed with her. It's a little awkward. Come on, Mr. Frost, all right? We just got married. You might as well, oh God, he has heart pajamas. Who in the Sims team choose that? They do remind me of our not so berry challenge though. Oh, Oh God. Okay, Louis is upset and he's gonna throw a temper tantrum. He's angry about, oh, he wants to hit Clement. He's like, you're not my real dad. Oh my gosh, they keep breaking everything. Stop breaking my stuff. You're costing me money. Oh, Bentley's upset. Okay. Oh my God. And as usual, Chanel's like, I'll take care of Bentley. Okay. I don't know if that's very helpful. Oh, Cash likes fitness. Good for you, Cash. And oh, some kids at school were being mean to one of my friends. Poor Dior. She's such a softy. I wanted to help, but I don't know what to do. Kaylee would be like, ugh, stay out of it. <laughs> Kids, please, please stop. Okay, go, go to sleep. All right, you also go to sleep and Clement will take care of the baby. Cash is cleaning up because he's such a good boy. Who is this person? Taku Amiyana, you should like leave. Like, please leave. Oh my gosh, she's gonna self woohoo. Your wife is in the bed, just go to bed. Oh my gosh, she went to bed naked. I don't wanna see Santa this way. Why don't you eat your grilled cheese sandwich, Cash? Okay. Oh, and he wants to do little sit-ups. Oh my gosh, she's gonna be such like a hot billionaire kid. You know what I mean? Like, he loves fitness and music. Like, he's gonna have all the ladies and men into him. Oh God, Kaylee is throwing up, you know? She's gonna leave that, obviously, because it's not her job to clean up. She has hired someone to do that. Why don't you go back to sleep, darling? You go to sleep too. Cash, why don't you also go to sleep? It's Saturday. She means all my kids aren't going to school. Nanami Ito is saying congratulations for marrying Clint. Nanami, you are the sister of my ex-husband. Like I just ruined his life for Santa. A little sus. Oh, look, it still says left side is for Kiyoshi Ito. I miss him already. Oh. Oh my gosh. He's not for Kaylee, but I love him. Oh, Thorn Bailey is calling his... Oh, Thorn must be so lonely if he's calling to ask his toddler for advice. He's like, I heard my boss saying I could be good candidate for a promotion. Do you think I can do it? And he's asking his toddler son, Louie, and Louie is gonna say, no. <laughs> No, Louis would probably be like, yeah, go for it. Thank you for the encouragement. I will try to get it. Okay, Louis encouraged his dad. How cute is that? Okay, who's up first? It's Dior. Oh, and she's not feeling very good. She's dehydrated. Okay, we'll go get a glass of water downstairs. Okay, who else is up? Oh, it looks like Chanel is up. Started taking care of herself, but she's got skin redness. Oh no. You know what? Mom could get you. Mom can get you daily treatments for your skincare. You're welcome, my sweet baby angel. Dior's gonna go to the bathroom. And she gave me a glass, which means 70 simoleons for me. <gasps> There's no more food. Uh-oh. Okay, can we hire someone? Hire a caterer. Well, I guess she can have a quick meal. Yeah, she's gonna have a quick meal. What a what a cute little bean. Oh, she had a sentiment with Kaylee. Friendly advice. Oh, that's very cute. Chanel, oh my gosh. She wants to chat with Jeb, who has a bag over their head. Where is Jeb? Is Jeb invisible? Do you have an invisible friend? Chanel? 
all up. I'm watching. I want to see if the sim shows up or if this is an invisible friend. Oh, Dior, why would you clean up? And she's got the farts. Great. Can you believe she just cleaned up? Okay, Chanel's Jeb has never shown up, so that's interesting. All right, go breastfeed the baby. I know you need to pee. You can pee after you feed the baby, though. I'm sorry. Sometimes that is the way it is. Baby eats first. Oh, she just peed herself, though. <sighs> Feels bad. Okay, well, why don't you go take a shower? Ooh, it's rough. Oh, yuck, that's gross. We're gonna leave that for the maid. Yikes, 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 yikes. Oh, maybe Clement Frost can cook something for everyone. You know, maybe that's, oh, he can't cook anything. All right, you're gonna make a party size garden salad. Everyone's gotta start somewhere and it is an Impeachishme family tradition. Oh, Chanel's gonna come ask him advice. How cute is that? Haley's like pretty happy about being married and having her new baby on the way and having this new baby. Chanel is hungry. Oh, but but he didn't finish. Why didn't you finish? Resume the garden salad, you do? Where are you going? Goodness, go finish the garden salad. Why does he keep trying to get into bed? That's for children. I don't know. Clement Frost kind of creeps me out. Hey, honey, it's dad. Oh my gosh, I always forgot that Dior's dad is, is Mortimer Goth. When are you going to come visit? Why don't you come over right now? Okay, Dior's gonna come hang out with dad. Maybe blow some horns. Clement, why are you, oh my gosh, he is so glitched. I don't know what his deal is. Clement, stop, all right? Oh, so Cash says, I got a present that I think is dumb. I want to trade it with a friend or give it back. Can I do that? Yeah, give it to someone else. This is what his mom's gonna say. Normally I would say like the present was for you. You should be grateful for it. It's not as much about whether or not you like it. It's more about the thought of the person that cares about you. But <laughs> Kaylee would just be like, yeah, I don't care. Like free gift it. <laughs> All right, there's the salad. Everyone can get a salad now. You get a salad and you get a salad. All right, everybody gets some food. Mom is washing Louie. There we go. Okay, now she's gonna go get a salad and Louie's gonna go get a salad. Oh, I love Louie's little backpack. He's such a cutie. And Haley needs some fun. So you know what you should do? After you finish your salad, go out. She's gonna have a night on the town and she's gonna have a club gathering. Yes. Yes, Kaylee. She's gonna go to the rooftop lounge in Shan Mishuno and she's gonna invite her girls out and it's gonna be a girl's day, even though she's probably supposed to have a fancy dinner. We'll have the fancy dinner tomorrow, okay? We need to hang out with the ex-wives club. Ex-wives club gathering has started. Oh, heck yeah. Let's go, ex-wives. Talk about grilled cheese. You've been eating it a lot. Be like, hello. Yes, Octavia. Oh my gosh, look at these ex-wives. I love them. Although they all need to have like a uniform maybe. We're gonna just make the style polished. They all have to wear polished outfits, okay? Okay, there we go. Now we're polished. Oh, who's this? Senji, oh, he's a teen. That is a handsome looking teen. It's so hard to tell the difference between teens and like adults. Although Bjorn is an elder, so you can tell he's an adult. Oh my gosh, everyone's such a fan of Octavia Moon. I forgot that she's like way more famous than us. <laughs> But he's a fan of ours. Oh my gosh, look at us. We're like little celebrities. This is too chaotic. Wait, Lily Nakamura, she remarried. Oh my gosh, after her husband died at our wedding, she remarried. We should have married Octavia Moon. I don't know why we thought marrying her husband would have been better. Oh my God, we're celebrating New Year's together. I forgot it was New Year's. Oh, and look, it's Makoa, who's also very cute, but I think he is married, yeah. He's married. Not for us, not for us. All right, let's like end our gathering and go home. I think we had like a nice gab with our girlfriends. We like complained about our husband and we, I don't know, hung out and gossiped and were nice to each other and talked about New Year's. Oh my gosh, Louis scared of the fire? Oh, he's thinking about the time it was on fire and he's looking at a fire. That's really sad actually. Our poor baby. Oh my gosh, Chanel, don't make a mess. You're was watching TV. The maid never came today to clean. Hmm. We still have a maid. Oh, well. Are you really watching the New Year's TV from outside? Why don't you go sit down? Is it because your ex-husband's here that you don't want to? Or what's the reason for this? Oh, they're all like counting down, I think. Yeah, they are. It's New Year. Oh my gosh. They all counted down and she missed it because she's super pregnant and needing to use the toilet. Go use it. I know they're gross, but you got to use the toilet. Oh, he can't came in to give her a hug. She's like, I'll wait, I guess. <gasps> Cash has entered the picky eater 
face. How cute is he? He like is like, I won't eat that unless it's gourmet and organic. That's cash. Louis just playing over here. And oh my god, next to mom's pee. I forgot that we never cleaned that up because I thought that the maid was gonna come today. All right, Dior, why don't you go use the toilet, get some food? Chanel is eating some stuff. Cash is already. Oh, Cash is celebrating. That's so cute. Yeah, you could celebrate. Kaylee's already asleep. She's tired. Clement Frost is washing his hands. You can do whatever you want, Clement. I don't care. It's okay, we're gonna have our dinner party tomorrow. The host is Kaylee. The guests are Clement. Cash, you're invited to the dinner party because you're old enough. And then Holly Alto, because she's our friend. Bella Goth's like randomly our friend now too. I can't believe we're such good friends with Naoki. <laughs> Octavia Moon. And that's it, I think. Miko, as usual, is our caterer. And it's gonna be at the Bailey Moon residence at do like a 5 p.m. It'll be like an early dinner. But maybe today she'll go out and try to meet someone new. Just scout, you know, whose houses might be already pretty nice. It's Sunday, all the kids are playing around. Maybe you should play some more piano, my little maestro. Oh, he was sleeping upstairs. I feel like this marriage is not going well if Clement is constantly wanting to sleep in other places. All right, we call it a repair service, so we won't have to like replace the object as much. Oh my gosh, our daughter's literally doing push-ups in our bedroom. Like, Chanel, what are you doing? Let's travel, okay? We're gonna travel. It's 7.30 a.m. Perfect time to go, you know, look at different people's homes. McCurdy? What is this? Judith Ward is married? Hmm. She doesn't have to stay married. But this does complicate things a little because I do have to break up a marriage. I thought Judith was like single. But look at this house. I mean, it's ugly. I do not like it. But how could you not, you know? Okay, Judith Ward, can we introduce ourselves? Okay, let's attempt an introduction. Come on. Oh God. Kaylee, imply attraction? Oh my gosh. <gasps> it worked, Judith liked it. Oh my gosh. Wait, they already have romance and it is in front of Sawyer McCurdy. Oh my gosh. Ask about interests. Be like, Judith, what are you interested in? Share a personal story. Compliment her appearance. Oh, this is insane. I can't believe we, we, this is going so well. I really thought like that she wouldn't want to talk to us. She also has a young kid. She's got Reginald McKerney and like a toddler. I feel kind of weird about this, like messing with this marriage, but uh, we got to finish this challenge. And I think she might be one of the richest Sims. I might have to wreck your life. All right, I'm, I'm not happy about it. Let's go knock on the door. You need to use your restroom, please Judith. Like, okay, wait, look at this house. There is no way we couldn't finish the mansion aspiration. I feel like Kaylee's like, oh my gosh, the moment I walked in her home, I knew I needed to marry Judith Ward. Or we could steal Judith's husband. That's another thing. Like we don't actually have to marry Judith. We could marry Sawyer, but I feel in my heart, I want to marry Judith. Kiss her hands. <gasps> Go kiss her hands. Go kiss her hands. Oh my gosh. Oh, Judith didn't like it. Make a naughty suggestion. Wait, really? Ask for a hug? Oh no. Okay, she let us give her a hug. So that's good. Okay, Judith, come on. First kiss? No way. Oh my gosh, this is wild. I am so confused as to what's going on because it's like, it's still clear she's very famous, but we're like kind of hitting on her and she's kind of liking it. Can they woohoo? No way. No way is this gonna work. Oh my God, is this gonna work. I'm very sorry. What? Oh my gosh. We just walked into her house and Judith Ward is going to woohoo with us in her bed. <gasps> No, <laughs> no. Oh my God, but look at this room. Like they would make the perfect pair. They would be a power couple of feminine strength. And I love this for them. Oh my gosh. We just went in and seduced Judith Ward with very little effort. Oh my God. This house is very big. So I feel like we could section off bits and pieces. Oh my gosh, look, there's a vault. We've got to live in this house. There's no way. It was built for Kaylee. Oh my gosh. We're going to be vibing Judith now. Okay, wait, are you serious? How come we ha don't have like more relationship than that? Okay, no, we do. Okay, we. she's not like too famous for us now. We're comfortable to talk to her. So that's good. Come back up, Judith. I want to talk to you. 
too. Share big news. Okay, let's take a photo together. I bet we can now. Yes, okay, that'll make us like really good friends. We're going through the elders right now. Okay, she's like anything, of course. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I am shocked right now that she's getting a photo with her. Oh my God, look at them, they're good friends. I am shocked right now that this is going so well. First kiss, you already woohooed. <laughs> Okay, we have a kiss with Judith. Repeat, we have a kiss with Judith. Embrace her. Oh my gosh, Judith is making out with our neck. Ask Judith to be your girlfriend. Oh my gosh, this is very serious. We just walked in and swept Judith off her feet. Did she say yes? Is she my girlfriend? Oh my God, in, in front of her family too. Like, I am literally shocked. This is going way too well. Judith just said yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Judith is officially our girlfriend. We need to convince Judith to end her romantic relationship with Sawyer. This is happening so quickly. Be like, wouldn't you want a newer model? Uh, really? I guess we are not that great of a couple. I should end it already. Oh my God. Is she going to do it right now? Oh my God. I want to watch this. I want to watch this happen. <gasps> oh my God. I think they're divorcing. Oh my God. He's so mad. She's like, get out of my house. I haven't been happy for a while. I ended it with Sawyer. You and I should go out sometime to get help me forget about him. Oh my God. God, this drama. Kaylee's like, <laughs> I'm irresistible. Professor dying love. I'm obsessed with what's happening right now. This is great. We got to finish this thing with Clement though. And then we can finally get married to Judith. Offer a massage. She wants to woohoo with someone. I mean, listen, can they woohoo in the vault? No, I think that's a missed opportunity that you can't woohoo in the vault. To be honest, there's only a place to woohoo on the bed. I can't believe believe this is happening. That was way too easy. All right, one hot last woohoo for the road, then we gotta go back home to our husband to have a, a fancy dinner party. <laughs> I mean, this this house is truly absolutely gaudy. No, I don't want to be a low orbit specialist. She's exhausted because she's been woohooing another Sam on the side. Oh my God, the drama. But we got to go home because we got to make it to the dinner party. She's the host. She's in her fancy wear. We're gonna have to have to give a full makeover for when she marries Judith. I'm thinking every outfit is gonna change. All right, she's going home, but she's got Judith Ward in the bag. In the bag. <laughs> okay, everybody's here. It's the dinner party. We gotta make a garden salad as we always do. I also love having these because that means I have a ton of food. All right, go make a party sized garden salad for your party. She is looking very cute. Oh, Kyoshi Ito is calling. He said, Thorn Bailey and I were planning to spend some time together. Should I do it? Um, Kiyoshi, are you asking for my permission to date my ex or are you asking to hang out with my ex? Either way, I think you should go for it. You know, maybe you two will be very happy together. <laughs> I can't believe he called us for advice on that. That is too funny. My ex-husband's fallen in love with each other. You know, I love that for them. I'm very happy that that is where they're going. We gotta thank a guest for coming. Oh yeah, yeah, I invited his dad as a guest because I thought it would be funny. So we'll go thank him for coming. I mean, he's still hot. You can still get it. Okay, and then call everyone to the meal. Come on, we gotta get gold. Excellent. Okay, boom, we're gold already. Oh my gosh, Akira Kibo's like, I heard he became friends with Judith. <laughs> what? No. Oh, how did that get out so quickly? Mm -hmm. Tell a funny story. Oh my gosh, Octavia looks great. Look at my two girlfriends, my gal pals. Tell a story. We're telling stories to everybody. Oh, look at how sweet Chanel is. Chanel, Chanel, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't put it in the sink. Don't put it in the sink. Chanel, Chanel, that's money. Chanel, just put all the money down the drain. I love you, Chanel, but I'm a little mad at you right now. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, I got all the stories done. We pretty much nailed this. And Clement Frost is playing with a toy and bonked himself on the head. There are two types of people. Kids that grow up too fast and adults that never grow up at all. I'm the adult that never grows up at all. Speaking of things that need to grow up, let's just go age up our baby. It's our baby birthday. Let's go celebrate and age up the baby. Did the person never come? Excuse me, the repair service needs to come. Please, please come and fix our toilets. All right, Clement, we're aging up our baby, Bentley, and then we are divorcing. <laughs> Bentley is a charmer. Aw, little baby Bentley is a charmer. I mean, I have a feeling Bentley is gonna be a, a big favorite because Bentley's an Edo, and you know, I'm a little bit biased. I'm not 
not gonna lie. Okay, I wanna see Bentley and create a sim, but only after we ruin Clement Frost's life, all right? She's walking by her friend and she's gonna go divorce him after the party. Oh my God, the party's not even over. I just realized, ooh, that's a messy dinner party. And then afterwards, she's gonna be like, thank you all for coming. And the party was gold. <laughs> Check out the sweet baby angel. This house is wrecked. She like busted all the toilets and all the sinks and everything. I feel like it's it's time to move. Okay, Bentley Ito, let me see your sweet little face, Bentley. Oh, the full cut. Bentley Ito is so cute and blonde. I wasn't expecting the blonde. I actually like the bull cut on him. I don't know why. It's just too, it's too cute. But we need a better little outfit for Bentley. So Bentley, oh my gosh, look how cute he is. Sleepy wear, I want to give you something really sweet. Like you're like a little animal or something. Oh, but I like that he's in this little like onesie. Oh, with a little <laughs> bunny on the butt. Okay, party looks. Like one of these, maybe? Yeah, that's nice. And we'll just do like a normal jeans. We're like very boring. I love the little things on the shoes, so cute. <gasps> Wait, let's give him some like cool, cool guy glasses too. <laughs> yeah, I like the yellow. Oh my God, how cute is this kid? Okay, this is too cute for cold weather. We gotta do this. We got little, little cold weather boots as well. Oh God, how cute is this kid? He's too cute. I'm obsessed. My whole heart. I love Bentley to pieces. I knew he'd be a cute kid because he had a cute dad. Oh my gosh. Bentley! Oh my gosh, little Bentley is born. Okay, Louie is angry pants. Bentley oh, is adorable. Kaylee just put him to bed. Clement, we broke up with you. Everything's finally fixed and they cost us money. Let's throw away some of these things. Like his, uh, his meal. We're gonna throw away your meal. You're done with that, right? Okay. Oh my gosh, he's naked again. All right, that's that's where I'm drawing the line. We're moving out, okay? We're moving. Actually, no, we probably should go ask uh, Judith Ward before we just randomly move out. Okay, shoot. Cash's birthday is today. Oh, Cash, we're gonna have a great birthday party in your new house with your new mom. Don't worry about it. You're gonna be a teen. Oh my gosh, Cash is gonna be a teen. I can't imagine. Oh no, Bentley's upset. Bentley's not taken care of at all. Okay, Bentley's gonna get some food. Food, and then he needs sleep and attention and hygiene. He needs everything. Poor Angel. Oh my gosh, Bentley, I promise I'll try to take care of you. This is a lot of kids. But luckily it's a Monday, so they're all gonna go to school soon, which is very good. All right, well, it is now officially time, so let's travel. I think we should go over to her house and ask her if we can move in. I'm sorry, Bentley, we'll be back, all right? You're okay, and I'm sorry, kids. You all will go to school, I'm sure, hopefully. <laughs> Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh, I already chose Judith. All right, let's go back to Delso Valley. They're all off to school, which is good. Oh, we should propose. What? Oh my gosh, Kaylee's too sad. Okay, should we ask to like move in together? Ask to join household. There we go. Oh, why is she being insulting me? Oh, that's awkward. Oh, because Judith is mean, but we're still gonna marry her even though she's mean. No, it's perfect. Excellent. Okay, so we're all gonna move in with them. They're going to move out. Sorry. Only 100,000 simoleons? Are you kidding me? Okay, you know what? I'm not gonna do it this way. I'm gonna sell my house first. Okay, stop fighting with your betrothed, okay? Smooth apology. You're both in a bad place right now. Okay, wait, no, 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 we're not too sad. Okay, we're gonna propose. Will you marry me, Judith? I'm in love with you ever since we met yesterday and had a whirlwind romance. And Ju Judith said yes, even though she's very sad about her recent divorce. We are both divorced. Whoa, she jumped into our arms. Okay, cuties. Okay, we're engaged, which is perfect. Let's go home. I feel like this will be another excellent marriage. Very exciting wedding that's gonna come. Like a Hollywood wedding. Even classier than the one with Thorn. And I think I'm gonna just sell the whole house. We're gonna sell. Go propose to Judith. Hopefully she accepts and isn't mean about it, but we never know. Sorry to the family that used to live. <laughs> But I think we did like buy the house technically. So yeah. All right, let's sell it. <gasps> okay. Oh my God, hopefully we have enough money. Oh, we still are missing like 300,000 simoleons in order to do, well, wait, unless her home is already a mansion baron home, in which case we don't need to worry about that. All right, now let's split from the household and move. We're gonna move in. We're gonna take our kids with us. We're just gonna leave Clement Frost on this empty lot. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna take our kids with us, obviously. We're not leaving our kids behind. We love them. And Dulce Volley. Yes. All right, so we're gonna move you all out and then move you all in. Excellent. Clement, now you can live with the McCurdy's. I think you'll have a lot of fun, okay? 1,008,301 simoleons. Okay. <laughs> 
This might be it, guys. If the house can be Mansion Baron status, we'll have officially finished it, barring marrying Judith McCurdy and having, I think they would adopt together. I think that would be a cute like celebrity thing to do. Also just a cute thing to do in general. Like these two women adopt again together. So we should be like in the house already. Hopefully we like live. Yep. <gasps> Wait, where's the rest of my kids? Excuse me? Where are the rest of my children? <gasps> we did it though. Uh, aspiration achieved mansion baron. Wait, what? It just said achieved, but then we don't have enough columns. Hold up. Wait for it to fix itself. But also all of my children are gone. Okay, I'm gonna need to manage worlds because like all my children just aren't here and I want them back, okay? I feel like Mr. Frost giving me some pushback. Might wanna keep my kids, but I am not allowing that to happen, okay? I want my kids back. Yeah, give me my kids back. Oh my God, he took all my girls. How dare. Okay, now we all have all the kids. Okay, thank goodness. We did it. <gasps> See, we did it. <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, shut up and look at this house. Kaylee, you're living the dream. You know, your wife might be old and mean, but hey, all right, you're living the dream. Okay, so this is where the kids are gonna live. I wanted them to all have their own rooms. So I feel like we need to like divvy this up because I can't possibly have all the kids in one room. That sounds ridiculous. Don't be ridiculous, okay? So, so we have a door here for this bedroom. This bedroom gets a door. This bedroom gets a door. Okay, I feel like this back room should be Chanel's room. It just gives me Chanel energy. We'll make it in pink for Chanel. And then next door, I think can be Dior's room. Hers will be in blue. And they're all just gonna have like similar looks to the room. This is baby room. So baby room can be like a white maybe for baby. We're also gonna do like a different tone for the flooring. Be white and this like off-white cream. This is Cash's room. This is Chanel's room. This is Dior's room. And then Louis's room. Okay, and Bentley. Maybe Louis and Bentley will share. They'll be so cute together. And then we'll put little little kiddo beds in this room for the Todds. They're so cute. They'll just like sleep right next to each other. Like we don't want to be without each other. Okay, that's cute. This one's good for cash. Yeah, sure. But this girl would want it. So this is, she's, she ended up lucking out with her room. She's got like the fanciest room of all the kids. She, oh my gosh. She needs like a big old princess bed for sure. Yes. Oh my gosh. This is Chanel's room, of course. So cute. Oh my gosh. And then Dior. I think Dior would be more understated. She might like something more like this. Oh, that's cute. But it doesn't really match the background. Maybe we'll do this. <gasps> Yeah, it looks so princessy. And then this is the baby room. So we'll have like a little baby bassinet kind of thing. And then yeah, everyone's beds are in here. Perfect. Okay. Oh, we need a we need a little light for the kids' room. Wall light. Yep. They're not gonna go to sleep if they don't have a, a little night light for them. So there they go. Perfect. Okay, all the kids have their rooms. We're home! We did it! All we have to do now is get married to Judith Ward and adopt a baby. Oh my gosh. Judith, are you okay? Is Judith gonna die? Judith wants to be a mansion baron and she's not even one. That's hilarious. We are more of a mansion baron than she is. And we're a millionaire officially. Oh, she feels amazing. At last she can rest. That is not your bed, sweetie. That is your son's bed. This is your bed. So Haley is on the right and Judith will be on the left. There we go. Mom is tired, but Judith could give him a bubble bath. Go give Bentley a bubble bath, Judith, please. By all means. Michael Bell's trying to give us a job. We don't need a job ever again. We are good. Good to go. Everybody is returned from school. One of them has had their grades up. Oh, Chanel is exhausted. All the kids are wrecked and I feel so bad, but Chanel's gonna be so happy when she sees her new room. Oh my gosh, and it's Cash's birthday. I just wish all my Sims were like better needs wise because I want Cash to have a very special birthday, but they're all like dead inside. <laughs> Dior is getting used to her new bedroom. It's a lot. I agree, Dior. Like it is a lot. Okay. I won't, I won't lie to you. Oh, oh, how cute. Chanel's sleeping in Dior's room because she's probably like, this is a lot. <laughs> Bentley, did you ever get the bath from Judith? Excuse you, Judith. Like why not? What's that about? Ma'am, excuse me, ma'am. Go give a bath to Bentley, please. Using my future wife already to take care of my children. <laughs> Someone's calling Kaylee. Thorn Bailey and I just had a blast together. Thank you for your advice. <laughs>
I'm happy for you, buddy. I'm happy for you too. I'm really happy for you too. Welcome to the neighborhood. Oh no, I don't want a welcome wagon. Who is this? Are you famous? If you're famous, I'll say hi. Otherwise, get lost. We're just gonna sleep through it. She's a tired. Okay, everybody's taking care of their needs. For the most part, most people are good. Oh, the two bubbas. They're chatting with each other. How cute are they? Oh, Louie and Bentley are becoming besties. I can't believe all of my children are blonde except Cash. What are the chances that they all are blonde like Kaylee? Speaking of Kaylee, girl, you need to finish sleeping so that I can like plan your wedding. Cash talked to his dad today. What a cutie bean. Of course, Chanel is in mom's bathtub. Classic. And was talking on the phone to Deccan Goth in the bathtub. Be careful, Chanel, okay? I love that there's like a wing full of the children's rooms. I think that's really cute. <laughs> Judith is eating. I guess it's a fruit cake. I don't know, whatever. And listening to some music. Why don't you turn that off and then go to sleep in bed with your fiance, Judith? Oh my gosh. And we're gonna have another kid soon. When are we gonna have this kid? Oh my God, we're in labor. Okay, we are in labor. Repeat, we are in labor. All right, we gotta go. We gotta have this. Actually, we could just have it at home, to be honest. You know, that, I feel like that's a celebrity thing to do. She's like, home birth, whatever. I'm having the baby. Look at Kaylee. You started from the bottom, Kaylee, and now you're here having Clement from baby right before you marry Judith Ward and adopt your seventh child. Okay, and you guys suggested some baby names uh, on the last video. It's a girl. Okay, so this person said Tiffany and Sable are mentioned as gifts from in the Santa baby song. And I think that's really cute. So let's definitely name our child Tiffany Frost. I just feel like, oh, that's such a good name for a girl. So Tiffany Frost is now here. Oh my God, welcome to the world, Tiffany. Frost. Oh, she wants to get to know Akira. Sus. Tiffany, you are so dramatic, but we love you. Welcome, Tiffany Frost. That is the funniest name. I can't. Dior Goth. Oh, okay, Tiffany Frost is welcome to the family. So happy that Tiffany is a part of our little clan. We are dirty as heck, but we are officially a millionaire gold digger pending our final marriage and baby, which I think the baby is more so we could take the money later. So technically, I don't think we need another baby, but I guess we'll do it for the sake of, you know, finishing strong. So I guess this is the penultimate episode. I'm going to actually leave this one here with Haley enjoying her nice luxurious bath in her new mansion that she shares with her fiance, Judith. They're going to have the final episode, the finale, where Kaylee marries Judith and adopts their final child will, I guess, be next episode. And I hope you guys are having a very happy holiday with your friends and family, and I'll see you guys around the internet very soon. Bye!